So today we're going to be reviewing Isemiyaki Little Blue De Ese Porom. I know what you're thinking. This is a blue bottle. For everything, and this is one of those modern day blue fragrances that we think of today like uh, Dior Sauvage or Bou de Chanel, but it's definitely nothing like that. I would consider this more of a green fragrance. Now stay tuned and see what I have to say about this. If you're new to the channel, this is where I decant uh, to your fragrance reviews, lists, and everything else that's fragrance related. Let's get into it. Low Blue De Seporum is classified as a woody aromatic fragrance. It was launched in 2004. The mass perfume behind this fragrance is Jacques Cartier. He's created some of the most iconic fragrances such as the original Lisse Miyake, Low De Seporum. He's also created Giorgio Armani Aqua De Gio Porum. He's also the in-house master perfumer of Louis Vuitton. Now let's get in these tasty notes. The top notes are rosemary, lime, orange wood, mandarin orange, heart notes, cypress, juniper berries, ginger, lavender, pink pepper, base notes, atlas cedar, patchouli, oak moss, sandalwood, amber. Right off the top, you get a pop of citrus from the lime and the mandarin orange, but front and center is just the aromatic rosemary note, which creates a fresh and herbal mint vibe to the fragrance. The dry down is where this fragrance is going to shine. The beautiful rosemary note now melts together with the cypress and juniper berries, which creates a trifecta of smooth, fresh, green goodness. I get a little bit of the calming lavender mixed with the spiced ginger. Further in the dry down, I get some of the woodier notes. I feel this is a decent performer. I get around eight hours of longevity. The projection and sillage are pretty good for the first two hours. Due to the aromatic qualities, I feel this has such a beautiful sillage. It's one of those fragrances where it smells so much better in the air than up close on your skin. So my final verdict on Issey Miyake, Blue Blue de Issey Porom. Kind of reminds me of a gentle fresh breeze at the rain heart in the forest. This is a soothing and relaxing scent for me. An overlooked gem that's plagued by tons of flankers from this house. So I can definitely see why this is overlooked. It's one of my favorite scents to wear during the holidays. I wouldn't say this is for everyone. I would say this is for people who like herbaceous green and earthy fragrances. It also can be easily found at like the rack stores like TJ Maxx or Marshalls. So be on the lookout. I wouldn't blind buy this though. Thank you all for joining the Fragrance Shark, and I will see you next time.